and wait for the late game, they can definitely uh, really make it hard for Barrack X to take this one, Mike. In the mid lane, you know, XP is very important that fast in the fight and six is really pivotal. Top lane though, they did have a go into Nico Baby, but with that tombstone, it's gonna make it a lot harder. Now they're going to Kang, but Ifrit is falling low, he baits Nico back in. Can he find the kill? Ifrit, one more last hit, but he can't do it. They will get it with the Enigma eventually. In fact, Spaceman picks it up for himself. Spaceman now just trying to back out safely. He's got the teleportation available, but he does not go for it quite yet. Now he will. No decay available for one more second. Oh, he does not man. get in time he's gonna be really careful he will give the uh, the tombstone away and now spaceman trying to tp out he will be able to do so successfully although they will go for ifrit instead now the stampede is ifrit he might have to man fight this he's still trying to make a run for it and he will end up losing his life regardless now spaceman comes in after kang again but he's so tanky nico baby a double kill on him now the cold embrace as well spaceman cannot find the pickoff and with that it looks like that will be a triple coming out although it will be given to felix instead top lane Got though, John. One thing I did want to point out, in fact, hold that thought because FX has used the Doom on the Centaur now. So Sprout will come out, Spaceman. Oh. We had to drop a ward to get the vision, and the boat will come in as well from Azura. This will be a dead Centaur on the side of WG Unity. It seems because he can't get out of there safely for the moment. I say that, they will stampede and they will go into Ifrit again. Dreamcore was there to start off and Ifrit actually doesn't have any friends around him. He will try and manfight just a bit and now here comes FX. Though the Mystic Snake was there and he will find the final pickup on the Troll Warlord. FX will find a trade chasing FX and Harpy. Cuppy should end up falling though. Kang is also being chased down by Azura and Spaceman. And Kang actually goes for the TP. They have the X. They will keep him there. Meanwhile, FX now trapped in the tree line. Looks like he will eventually lose his life. He's quite tanky, but he does go down. Kang, meanwhile, still decaying. Stacking up that string. So, finally, will they take him? Yes, they do. The Tidebringer was there. The Spaceman trying to make a run for it. Now they'll change their mind. They'll go for Azura instead. Felix... Can he actually hold him down? He's not level 6 yet, in fact he's only level 4, but the Dream Call is there from nothing to say. And, well, the Conquer appears to be a lot tankier than we expected. The double braces are there. He's still gonna go for that push again. With Nature's Prophet and Enigma, it's very easy to keep push up like this. Oh, absolutely. Oh, FX. Dream Call and Winter's Curse. Timed quite incorrectly though. They do have the stun there. It should be a kill. Coming out into FX though, he scorched Earth, he does have that health regen, two decay stacks right now, FX surviving, now turns around, the Doom is put on the park with the Infernal Blade, they are going to continue the chase on this Doom, the Space Man comes in, now the boat as well, FX is so darn tanky, the boat will connect onto two, the Cold Embrace is there to try and help out this spot, and it does get denied, a very nice play coming out, in fact they will not get anyone though on the side of Barak X yet, they're low, falling low, that Infernal Blade can do a lot of damage, so they will change their mind and go for Nico Baby instead. Azura it needs to improve their execution here. The same mid lane. Doom was not available, so looks like they won't be able to find that. Turn around as well, they want to have a go into FX. He only has one to the Devour stack this time around. Then they will chase him down, Spaceman trying to help him out. Actually oh. does save him for the moment, though they will find him eventually, and it looks like Space and has just forfeited his own life and it up and Azura was there with the boat torrent follow-up. Nico Baby moving forward, just a Mystic Snake, they have found the Centaur and with that Velo should just end up going down here though, he does have help coming in. They do silence up popping on that Enigma and the Cold Embrace is there as well. Azura just trying to back off because that Stone Gaze, he does turn around though. The Doom is still there on the Centaur, now Cold Embrace as well. Harpy to Azura on that Kunkka, Unity. Well, he will back off Bello, he does get a stun off as well, and they'll find a trade in FX. And with that, they're turning around and going for even more on the side of the Dire. Who can they find? Azura will be the target. A nice double turret though does come out. Nothing to say though, making the chase. Can he hold him in place? The boat is there, the block's coming out. The double loot stop as well, coming out from Bello. And now the stampede as well. Azura though turns back around apparently, maybe baiting them out a bit. Ifrit will get started on his own. He's just going to man fight everybody, and they have to see the Azura for the moment though he does end up going down and with that though Ifrit is ripping apart the side of WG Unity in the back lines and Spaceman he does miss up the hill and Felix is still healing himself up with the urn Nico Baby will be the target they do have the sprout available Ifrit still 
trying to hit up Nico. Cold Embrace is there to protect him. Meanwhile, nothing to say. He will find Spaceman. They have found the Medusa and Ifrit still looking for more. The slow axes were there though. Felix should be able to get over that cliff and if I'm correct, uh, 26 minutes in. Kind of forgot how fast time is going, John, but it's a late black hole. The Kang will also get caught out and with that stun, he should be pretty easily just dead. Yeah, Infernal Blade comes in. He's delaying it as much as he can. That Sprout is there in the end and he's gone. Oh, top lane. Bellow. Chased down by Harpy. Now Space Man's here as well. The Midnight Pulse has come down to Bellow. But trying to go for a hoop stop. He does use the Stampede as he gets sprouted. And they do send him up while the TP is going on. And Bellow. I'm not sure why. Nobody was really near them unless they're trying to go for Harpy. Nico Baby though. Was trying to be engaged on by Ifrit. They got the X off onto the Centaur, and it looks like Bello should just end up falling. Though nice hoop storm comes out, and the Cold Embrace to save as well. Winter's Curse is there, and with that, it looks like it will be enough damage on the Doom. But no, not quite yet. The Guiding Greaves was there just in time. They do end up finally finding Spaceman in the back lines. In fact, that was the top lane. And nothing to say. Will TP back up to try and help out? Azura going for more. They will find the Wyvern and they do take him out. Now Bellow, one man who stopped at the black hole. Where is it? It doesn't actually come out. It doesn't even need to come out. The Doom is there in the center and he's gone. Kang! One more high pick would have done it, but the Stone Gaze does save him in time. The Nico Baby still trying to man fight under all this damage. With that, Spaceman bore back and will end up dying back. That's a big pickup for the side of WG Unity at the very least. And nothing to say, but they ended up getting away and they'll smoke themselves now. So they want to have a go with this engagement. Can they find anybody though? Azura, he will get the X off and this is a bait. Stone Gate does come out, Imprint will get stunned off the Bellow instead. They're just roaming around them. Huffy, he gets caught in the Dream Core, so he can't actually get in range to Black Hole. And they will Winter's Curse up that Troll Warlord. In fact, no, that was the Kunkka, Ifrit. He is chasing Kang right now. Azura jumps back in, does get the X off onto Felix. Bellow, nice double move stop. Nico, what can he do? The Black Hole does come out. It is on the two heroes. They will find Kang first, but can they find Nico? The answer is absolutely not. And Azura might have to back up and back Spaceman. Will end up being the train losing his life, but they do find the Infernal Blade onto Nico, baby. If it can he deal the damage, he needs a lucky bash. The butterfly is there on the Medusa. Which makes it a lot harder on Ifrit to actually take take him down with that damage, and he actually just can't. He missed way too many times. They might be able to find Bello, but it looks like they just want to get out of there safely now. Felix continuing the chase though with that splinter blast. They will turn their attention to FX, and FX is just forfeit at the moment. He is just gone. We felt severely underwhelming here, Mike. The fact that you're just basically trailing behind the troll is really not a good sign. Azura, mid lane, they get caught out. The Dream Call as well. Azura, he does get himself up though. And now Winter's Curse is there just on the Kulka. They will get Bellow out safely. Puppy does not have Black Hole for another 15 seconds, so he can't really engage quite yet, but they are delaying this as much as they can. Hoopstop again coming out from Bellow onto Azura, though he is so darn tanky on that Kunkka. They'll continue the chase. The Dagon was there as well. Felix is there now. Ifrit, he will man up and try to go for anybody he can. Cold Embrace is there on the Undying. Azura, he will buy back throughout this team fight. Now they're going to go onto Ifrit. That'll be a massive kill if they can find it. Boat is not available quite yet, but the Doom is there on Nico Baby, and he's falling very, very low. They will heal him up just a bit, but he is gone. Now Huffy, he has the Black Hole available. He doesn't have anyone to use it on though. Bello is still making the run for it, but Felix is there with uh, with uh, FX and Huffy, and they will take him down. And with that, WG Unity, they lost two in that engagement. Initiation, I feel like, well, with, especially with Winter's Curse and the uh, Dream Coil, you have a lot more options to disengage and engage from WG. When it comes down to Barricades, it's really just a big black hole. Yeah, well, they have the central bot lane. x boat is there, as well as the Doom coming up towards the, uh, the Dire base. But double damage rune. Is he actually going to go and try and sneak a T3 tower? He can go through backdoor protection with the double damage, and he does do so now. He's trying to force up the, the buyback, and they'll go for the Medusa. It's a lot of damage, John. He might actually end up dying here. The Cold Embrace is not enough. 
Ifrit will just take him out by himself, and now Kang loses a lot of HP. He's going to turn his attention around onto that many barracks instead. They have held Huffy in that Dream Core, but can they deal the damage? He's still alive throughout all this. But he will end up finally dropping the puck, will not get ensnared throughout all that either. Ifrit still going in the back lines. He does have the cheese available. Velo, double hoot stop, but Azura is on his case and will find him. Ifrit, meanwhile, went for the T4 Tower as well that was happening, and now the Cold, the Winter's Curse, excuse me, does come out and Azura does not end up losing his life the cheese does come out from here for just in case as well and in fact, they're gonna go for even more Felix making a run for it they can't find the puck he's just way too slippery but FX just keeping their attention towards him fortification is there but that Moe Barracks is not gonna last long at this rate FX Still running, Guardian Creeps will not protect him enough, but they've got a dump to Barracks coming out. In fact, Ifrit, he might find Mega Creeps right now, because Spaceman, he continues to delay them and keep their attention towards him. And WG Unity cannot actually go after the Troll Warlord right now, because they can't get past Spaceman, who continues taking up all this damage. He runs, sprouts, can he get himself out of there? He's just delaying it, and he will do so, because there's Mega Creeps coming out for the side of Barrack X, so what a play! being made by the side of the Radiant. They're going to go for more. The fight isn't even over. They'll go out the Felix. The boat will be there, but it won't really land on the Winter Wyvern. Ifrit, he just has some love for these towers, John. He has not hit a hero in a long time. He continues going <laughs> after those T4 towers, and it looks like it might just be an ancient play. They're diving the Bouncer basically right now. FX is just so darn tanky, and this is GG well played. Barrack X, they had enough, John. This game was taking way too long for their style and they just moved here.